as life progresses, adversity gets harder. And the like the mountains you start climbing, like you start coming across, you know, it, like my challenges now are very different from my challenges when I was 25 years old. I would say they're much harder uh, because the stakes get higher. You know, like it, I, that's just what I've found to be true in my personal life is like, the thing that's going to get you to the success that you want more than anything is going to be your ability to persevere over long periods of time. That takes care of getting the money that you want. It takes care of getting the success that you dream of. Uh, it puts you in the place that you want. Can't quit, can't give up. If you do, you, you lose. That's the way you lose. That's how we do it at Southwest. Yeah. Throw your lightning bolts up. How I approach every single day, uh, it's with a relentless attitude. Who runs the best meeting? We do. Don't do the easy thing, do the hard thing, and just try to be the best. And most importantly, never quit. You're gonna come to points, times that you, it's just hard, and you don't wanna do it. But that's why you're here. If it was easy, everybody would do it. Describe Southwind in one word or one phrase. What would you say? If I was gonna tell somebody, I'd go, it's real. Welcome back to another episode of Scoop Stories. <laughs> Shut the f what does that mean to you? You know what that means to you? It means it's a bit... <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, it's a little... Let me pipe that one down. Well, thank you for tuning in for another... <laughs> thank you for tuning in for another... Shut up. God damn it. You gotta be fucking... All you gotta do is touch your phone. <clears throat> Jesus. Let's go. <laughs> See, do that piss Josh off? I think everything's uh -huh. gonna piss them off. <laughs> we want to offer just you know a short apology for not being on the past couple weeks. It's been really, really busy here at Southwind HQ. Lots of mergers and acquisitions happening. Lots yes. of movement in the business. Yes, stoop stories, not to be confused with scoop stories. That's right. Hey Chip, can you take a look at the AC? Yep. So, I can't have you laughing though. <laughs> Alright, that's the first one to go now. Alright. Hey Chip, can you take a look at her AC? Yep. Hey Chip, can you take a look at her AC? Yep. Alright, make it work. Wow, these coils haven't been cleaned in years. Erin, she needs a system revitalization. Revitalize your M your Revitalize your AC with MVP. Chip, can you take a look at her AC? Yep. Wow, these coils haven't been cleaned in years. Erin, she needs a system revitalization. Revitalize your AC with MVP. Yep. Uh, so, you know, Kim, you and I have been friends for quite a long time, and uh, I feel like I have to open up to you, okay? I, uh, I used to have an addiction. Uh, I used to be addicted to eating soap, but I want you to know it's all okay now because I'm clean. It must have been very hard for you. Okay. How do you weigh a millennial? I don't know. In Instagrams. Nice. If you're an American when you go into the bathroom and an American when you come out, what are you in the bathroom? European. Damn it. Before I worked at Southwind, uh, I was actually the, the head of Old McDonald's Farm. My actual title was the CIEIO. <laughs> right, Jeff, I saved my best joke for last. Are you ready? I'm ready. Can't wait. <laughs> <laughs>